When Robin Wright isn't playing a conniving political wife on House of Cards, she's a socially conscious citizen in real life. That's one of the reasons she launched a new sleepwear line with longtime friend and designer Karen Fowler. Thank you very much for coming here today. Well, first question I would like to know is what is the background of、um, Poreless Fam? We have known each other for over 20 years, and Karen is a clothing designer. And about 22 years ago, we had a pajama that pajama. we loved, a pajama、Ooh. set. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I wore it to the point of holes in it, and I said I would love at some point for both of us to create this perfect pajama and make a company out of it. So, cut to 22 years later, it never happened in that time, <laughs> and、uh, she pursued her career as a clothing designer. And then I got involved、uh, with the crisis in the Congo, and I became the spokesperson for Raise Hope for Congo campaign. So I said, "Well, why don't we do both? We want to do these pajamas, and why don't we make it a give-back company and start with the Congo, giving part of the proceeds to helping through civil society groups, church-run organizations that bring women in and put them back on their feet." Oh, okay. So that's where this poor day、um, fam came from. Okay, but it actually started 22 years ago. Robin, as a artist, and right now I can say you are sort of like a clothing designer as well. What is your input into this brand? Oh, she has a lot of input. We we just des we design it all completely together.、Mm -hmm. She came up with the the patterns that are on our pajamas. We pick out fabrics together. We、um, We brainstorm about detailing. We go to vintage stores together, and we pick out things we like, and we we design it together. Flea markets in Paris or London, and you buy great vintage pieces, and we'll take that piece and go, "Ooh, let's do the lapel from this, or the ladder lace from that piece, and the hem from this, and the tailored waist of that dress," and we'll just build our number. The collection features everything from a classic PJ set that have feminine embroidery, the soft cottons to vintage-inspired nightgowns with delicate lace that are beautiful and comfortable, influenced by Fowler's grandmother. Really, the impetus for not only naming it pour la femme, which is for the women in、yes. French, it was centralizing around what's symbolic in pajama. We said security, safety, comfort, coziness, and it also appeals to the feminine in a woman, which is it's sexy. I'm wearing the solid PJ top right now, by the way.、And、we were like, we want to do something where you could wear it with jeans, jeans during the day, and you also are comfortable in bed. So we had all of those components for women, and then just expanded on that and said, why don't we just make a sleepwear line? Yes. All of the pieces for all different. Types of women.、Uh, we run size small through large, but the smalls fit really petite customers. We we sell mostly、um, media size medium in the U.S., but in an, in our Asian、um, clientele, it's more the smalls because it does fit size zero zero to probably a two or a four, depending on how tall you are. So I think the small it really does cover extra small and small、mm -hmm. size small. It does. Yeah. With a celebrity influence. Wright has garnered over the hit political drama House of Cards. She has also built a worldwide fan base who admire the strong and independent personality of her and her character Claire Underwood. Robin, you're under the spotlight a lot, but sleepwear is something that's very, very intimacy. How do you put the spotlight and being intimate together? Where do you find the balance? Well, really and truly, because it's a socially conscious product, I think it. Calls attention to itself for those very reasons, where you say, you know, it's it's a sleepwear line for women primarily, even though we do have a men's pajama set coming. And the link with intimacy means security. And intimacy is also how you reach the public. How do we expand? How do we get reach? That is. Beyond what we could do, just talking about it, that's intimate. Is to be able to speak to you, and then you speak to somebody else, and so on and so on.、Um, that was again the impetus for this. Claire Underwood, you know, she's very well dressed at home as well, 
right? Do you think you know for whatever you're wearing right now, this very cute pink pajama shirt can be something to be wearing at home while you're working? Well, you know, we laughed about that. You actually came up with that idea. You said, well, maybe at Camp David. <laughs> Where it's more casual, she would wear a cut because Claire Underwood, ne she wouldn't be found dead in cotton. Sorry. Oh, really? I mean, that's, you know, kind of a running joke on the set. It's like yeah. silk and cashmere and nothing else. Kind of thing. In addition to the sleepwear, the two designers created a sleep mask with the words Dream Bigger written in bold letters. With proceeds from each sale, the business partners aim to bring in financial support that will help some of the most endangered and impoverished women in the world. It's so inviting, I think, just collectively as human beings. You know, when you say, you want to do this with me? Come do it with me. Instead of, I'm over here in the spotlight and I'm going to speak down at you. It's like, no, collectively, we can do so much more. The information of Pour the Fam is loud and direct. The design isn't just about offering women quality PJs. It's also focused on being a socially conscious fashion line with proceeds from sales donated to assist women who are victims of violence. Charlene Shen, CCTV News, Hollywood.